This is Marco Wu from eProgrammer.com. I'm going to talk about how can we use MATLAB OD45 to solve a very simple uh, second order differential equation. Now we have this problem. Uh, y double dot plus 5y dot plus 7 is equal to 0. With the initial condition y dot equal to 12 y is equal to 21. So how can we do it in MATLAB? So first of all, we need to make a function. I have already do it. So if you look at here, my function, my output function is equal to my ODE45 function. And with the input variable t comma y. Okay, so my output my output can be any name, my OD45 function can be any names. So T and Y, basically, you can use any names. So, but one thing we need to make sure is, okay, um, in here, the my output. The my output in here with this two order. This one is equal to the DY over dt. Do you, this one in here is equal to y double dot. So so if uh, we always I uh, like to use a uh, y to represent the, the distance or the height. If you are talking about y is the height, then this one in here, the first variable in here is the velocity and this one in here is the acceleration. Okay. Don't mess up the order. And you need to think about like this one in here is y2 because in the in the output, the output I will going to talk later, this variable is represent the velocity and you have the y1 which doesn't appear in here is represent the height which is the distance. Okay. So you have the height which doesn't need to be in this my output function and you have the velocity which is the first variable in this um, uh, array and your second variable in here is represent the acceleration which is the differentiate of the velocity which is the differentiate of the differentiate of the um, uh, height okay don't mess up with the order Okay, so it's very straightforward in here, okay? Now, um, go to the main code. I create all, basically I uh, just create all the variables. Okay, now, now, well, what, one more thing. You need to generate two uh, M code. This one is the function code. This one is the warning code. You use the warning code to warn the function code, okay? Warning code, function code, okay, now time period anything you want this one is the initial condition okay do you remember like just now I told you the function in the um, my ODE 45 the first one is the velocity the second one is the acceleration this initial value in here is different what difference the first one in here is the height which is the y the second one in here is the y dot okay there is no uh, initial variable, initial value for the acceleration. So, in the ODE function, the function you create, you there are two variable in the array. The first one is the velocity. The second one is the acceleration. For this initial value in here, the first one is the distance. The second one is the velocity. Okay, okay. So now I put it this in here. This is the main running code t basically is a uh, giving return the every point of the t array in here within the this time period y in here it will create you two um column okay uh i will talk about that in a second my ode function which is the one you create remember you need to have this add in here before this uh my ode function ode 45 function okay and the time period which is I define it here and the initial uh, value in here. Once again, the first one in here is the what is that? 
the distance. Second one is the velocity. Okay, now if I want this code, I'm going to port it. Uh, I will I, I will port to you like in a second. But for the result for the first column is the y, which is the distance. Okay, I put it in here. The second column is the velocity. Okay, now I'm going to run it now. Run it. Okay, now in here, this one is a time, uh, time distance port. This one is time velocity port. I'm so sorry, this one like, for some reason it creates something like that. But you need to remember like you are having, you use uh, MATLAB to generate two things. One is the distance uh, port, the other one is the velocity port.